That's not supposed to be there. But I have changed the whole appearance of the appearance of my game and um yeah. As you guys can see, I literally have just a whole new background and everything. And I do want to edit this a little bit. My like literally my artistic like everything has to look good if I'm making something with art. That's just the way it is with me. Oh my god, that looks ugly. That looks terrible. Okay, well. That. 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 that, that, that. Okay. Oh, uh, no. Alright. Okay, sure. We're go we'll go with this. Or, you know. Let's, 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 why not just make it daytime? Just it's simple. Okay. That color just hurts my eyes. Okay, I know. We can make this darker though. So do that. Alright, we gotta make this like boom. Okay, you know what? You know what? I'm literally just gonna <sighs> choose the blue sky as the background. I'm just, you know what? We'll just go with that. I really don't care. We we gotta get on with the video. Okay. Um. Okay, do that. All right. So. I have myself, so I just remove the rolling thingy because I'm using a square now, so it doesn't turn anymore. But this is what I have, and so today we're gonna be basically making um newer. I'll uh, we'll make a leveling system where we can swap level. We can swap between levels, and I will make um. A death system. So, yeah. Um, wait, okay. Walk on, just literally just gonna do that. Okay. Alright, so. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's just forget the text. Um,. Okay, so we're gonna make uh, just like two or three levels just for the purposes of this tutorial. But I'm just gonna add a few gaps right there. And now we can just, you know, erase it all up because we won't need this then. Why not? Alright. Do that. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Almost there. Okay. Still not quite done. Okay, there. So, we have a gap that we can fall through. And then we can duplicate that. And then I'm literally just going to add some lava. All right, boom. So now we have three levels. Okay, there. Boom, lava. Well, technically, this this does not look lava-like. So let's make it look more lava-ish. 
there we go that looks more lava ish and after we have that what we can do is do in the level when we inside plague we can switch costume to costume one and that'll be like that and now we're going to add a little portal at the end of everything. So at the end of the level, just add a little portal. There we go. And this is where your players are going to finish the level off at. And I just added three of them. And now we can do... Oh, wait, right. We also added a dash system, if you guys remember. Oh, I totally forgot about that, but... Uh, yeah, alright. So now, wait, what is this stuff? What the? Okay. Alright, well, now we can do, uh, when we if I click, forever, if touching color, and then the color of the portal, we can broadcast. Wait, put that in there, and there. Okay, we can broadcast next level. Okay. And then we can do when I receive next level, next costume, and also on here in the hitbox, when I receive next level, next level, then we can go back to the starting spot. Boom. So. We, okay, yeah, we have that. Oh, wait, you know, wait, wait, wait. So, in the level? So, the portal shouldn't be in the level. I made that big mistake. The portal should not be on the level. In the portal should actually have a... Okay. The portal should have its own sprite, but it should go to a corresponding spot. So, look. On this level, we'll put it right here. So we can copy this, and on costume three, we can put it over here. So also, so, and then if in one level, uh, let's say this, and I do that, that, and then like, I, I just have this, and like, you know that and I want the portal to be up there I would put oh wait, 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 wait. let me take the portal and then I would put the portal right up there and then I would copy it I would make a new sprite and then I would paste it and that would be up there so that would be the right spot in the level so now, in the portal, we can do when we fly click, go to zero, zero. And then, um, we can switch costume. Oh, yeah, switch costume to costume one. When I receive next level, next costume. There we go. So, we have that. We have the, we can switch levels. And our portaling system works. Nice. So now what all, what we can do is we can also make a death system, which we like have to do. So we duplicate this and we switch ourselves to the lava costume and we do if touching that, then broadcast death. And then over here, Duplicate this and just do when I receive death. So now, if you well, actually, then we can also duplicate this and we do jagged or equal to and oh, wait. okay, so we can do equal to or greater than. Um. Uh, if Y position, so we can do Y position. Okay, so this number, uh, the 50, 
Is this kid? We're gonna do that. All right, that number is gonna depend. So we can do that. Okay, look. So you want your character to fall and number over here, that's negative 185. We can type it up here, negative 185, negative 185, there. Wait, my position is good. Oh wait, it's supposed to be less than, not greater than. Oh, less than. Negative 185, okay. There. And now, if my character falls, it'll die and it'll respawn. Very nice. And also when it touches the, yeah. All right, so that's that. But what if we, uh, so this this right here would be your basic game, just your basic gameplay completed. You know, you have death system, uh, you can move around, you have levels. And also one neat little trick that I've learned is that you can make a level It'll literally just be like, you start on a platform like this, and you have to get to like this platform. And then there's some text that says, think outside the box. All right. So in this one, what you would do is you would literally stand on the text. And I'm, I'm just gonna make the, this, the portal float. So, we'll go like that. And actually, that's a, that's a pretty good spot. There we go. So now, if we complete our levels, all right, boom, boom, boom. Okay, wait, this level is incompletable. So, speaking of that, we can make a trampoline. So, um, let's actually call this, um, extras, okay? And we're also going to make ourselves a trampoline on this, um, same thing. So, over here, we could uh, give ourselves the color purple and draw a line with that, but that is way too thin, so we could do that. Boom, that our, that's our trampoline. I'm gonna copy that, and then we'll paste it on that same one. And there, now we can do, um, here, Oh, uh, wait, actually. If touching color and that purple is color, then we can do a trampoline. And then when I, uh, hitbox is when I receive trampoline, then we would, uh, uh one little thingy. We would set Y bell, so I just get the Y bell variable. To 20 so just like that so you can see this game is very easily customizable and like you could ju you could do like anything you want with this and all right so you touch it and you'll bounce and then you can walk over the text and do that so guys that is pretty much it for this video if you enjoyed, be sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I will see you guys next time. So, peace out.